2018 Jeep Cherokee Review. The Cherokee has excellent off-road ability, however it's perfectly suited to the urban jungle, too. The 2018 Jeep Cherokee is unique from the competitive small crossover segment because of its exceptional off-road ability. That's what Jeeps are recognized for, particularly Jeep's trail-rated Trailhawk trim. Ordered therefore, the Cherokee are designed for trails greater than any other rival. But most pers are simply just looking for a cozy vehicle to push every day, plus the Cherokee is beneficial on this front too. With a supple suspension as well as a strong V6 engine option, with an easy to say 4 inch touchscreen inside, the 2018 Cherokee is prepared with a daily grind. There are some downsides including lackluster acceleration in the Cherokee's standard four-cylinder engine along with a lack of cargo space. But if you need an affordable crossover SUV that may comfortably have you work in the week then hit the trail above the weekend, there is absolutely no better choice compared to 2018 Cherokee. What's new? The Jeep Cherokee returns for 2018 mechanically unchanged but there are several revisions for the trim structure. The Cherokee Sport disappears, making the Cherokee Latitude the camp trim level for 2018, a new trim level, the Latitude Plus, is added, and Cherokee Trailhawk and Limited trims get additional equipment. The Latitude trim also gains a whole new Tech Connect package with Amazon Alexa integration. Go with all the Trailhawk if the budget allows. While it's more costly than many of the other Cherokee trim levels, its exclusive feature set makes the many of the Cherokee's off-road abilities, that is the main reason to acquire a Cherokee rather than another crossover initially. Otherwise, the Limited Plus comes with a nice list of features to have an agreeable price. Trim Levels and Features The 2018 Jeep Grand Cherokee is usually a five-passenger mid-size SUV that is available in seven trim levels, Laredo, Limited, Trailhawk, Overland, Summit, SRT and Trackhawk. Most Grand Cherokees can be purchased with rear-wheel drive 2WD or four-wheel drive 4WD, Trailhawk is 4WD only along with the SRT and Trackhawk gets specialized all-wheel drive systems. All Grand Cherokees are reasonably well equipped but certain upgrades can be found only on higher trims, for example the 8.4 inch touchscreen and also the optional V8 engines. Standard feature highlights to the base Laredo will include a 3.6 litre V6 engine 295 horsepower, 260 pound feet of torque, an 8 speed automatic transmission, 17 inch wheels, heated mirrors, a rear view camera, rear parking sensors, keyless ignition and entry, do also an automatic climate control, Bluetooth, a 7 inch touchscreen with Android Auto and Apple CarPlay support, plus a 6 speaker audio system with satellite radio and 2 USB ports. The Laredo E package adds an energy adjustable driver's seat, a number of visual tweaks as well as the further replacement for add 18 inch wheels. The upgraded 8.4-inch touchscreen with navigation, heated front seats along with a heated tire, an energy liftgate and remote start. The Upland is really a further optional Laredo package and comes standard with Jeep's Kodru Track I full-time 4WD system much like what's about the Trailhawk, but with no low-range gearbox. You also get 20-inch wheels, a black head-out appearance package heated seats and tire, along with the option to add an electrical sunroof plus the 8.4 inch touchscreen with navigation. The altitude package with the Laredo trim keeps the black head out exterior trim but skips the typical 4WD. The altitude comes standard with heated front seats plus a heated leader, leather seats with simulated suede inserts, an electric liftgate, remote start and also the 8.4-inch touchscreen with navigation. The higher trim levels 9-speaker stereo can be an optional upgrade, as is often a sunroof. If you are considering more creature comforts, 
then read the limited trimmer level. On limited and above, it is possible to go together with the standard V6 or you'll be able to opt to the optional turbocharged 3.0 litre diesel powered V6 240 horsepower, 420 lbft of torque. The 5.7 litre V8 360 horsepower, 390 lbft can be obtained but only with 4WD. Other standard equipment around the Limited includes 18-inch wheels, remote start, auto dimming driver side and rear view mirrors, an electrical liftgate, a 115-volt power outlet, a heated tire, heated back and front seats, leather upholstery, power front seats and driver seat memory settings. Available options incorporate a dual screen rear seat entertainment package. A suite of driver aids adaptive cruise control, forward collision warning with automatic emergency braking, lane departure warning, parking assist, and automatic wipers, and also the luxury group 2 package, which adds the 9 speaker stereo, xenon headlights and automatic high beams, a dual pan sunroof, ventilated front seats, and electric adjustable controls, plus the 8.4 inch touchscreen with navigation. Most on-the-trail Hawks off-road gear could be added on the 4WD Limited together with the Off-Road Adventure 2 package. The Limited can be equipped together with a trailer tow package, which adds a Class 4 hitch receiver, 7 and 4-pin wiring harness, a full-size belly fat, load leveling suspension, and extra engine cooling. This towing device is a standard on higher trim 4WD Grand Cherokee variants. The Sterling Edition package is usually a variant with the limited design to celebrate the Grand Cherokee's 25th anniversary. It adds a substantial amount of chrome exterior trim, one impressive Sterling Edition badging, 20-inch wheels, and for the inside unique leather upholstery and extended leather trim. The 8.4-inch touchscreen, 9-speaker stereo, blind spot monitoring and rear cross traffic alert will also be standard using the Sterling Edition. The off-road oriented Trailhawk trim level is our choice for that Grand Cherokee. Without a doubt, it's one on the most capable off-road SUVs in the class. On top in the limited trim, it adds unique exterior styling flourishes, different 18-inch wheels with off-road tires, Four-wheel drive with low-range gear and Kodju Track 2 with an electronic rear differential that operates with a terrain-selectable traction control system Quadra Drive 2. The Trailhawk even offers an adjustable air suspension Quadra lifts with an increase of suspension travel as well as other Trailhawk-specific tuning, hill ascent and descent control, underbody skid plates, trim-specific interior styling along with an upgraded instrument cluster display with exclusive off-road features, power folding mirrors, ventilated front seats, an 8.4-inch touchscreen interface, a navigation system along with a 9-speaker head unit. Next from the Grand Cherokee lineup could be the Overland. It has a number of more luxury options and shares the Trailhawk Slatter 4 standard features also as a mainstream version of the air suspension. It's also designed with 20-inch wheels, automatic wipers, xenon headlights with auto high beam control, LED daytime running lights and fog lights, a dual pan panoramic sunroof, a navigation system, an electric adjustable tire and extended leather upholstery. The off-road Adventure 2 package is accessible, as they are the rear seat entertainment package, the active safety feature suite, along with the Trailhawks Quadra Drive 2 system. The high altitude package adds black head out trim, the suite of driver aids, plus a dual pan sunroof for the overland. Quadra Drive 2 and rear seat entertainment are offered options for high altitude equipped overlands, along which has a 19 speaker music system. If you wish most on the creature comforts that this Grand Cherokee offers, definitely evaluate the summit trim. It includes the overland's standard equipment plus polished 20-inch wheels, headlight washers, front parking sensors, a self-parking system both parallel and perpendicular, additional noise-reducing window glass, 
active noise cancelling technology, adaptive cruise control, blind spot monitoring with rear cross traffic alert, a forward collision mitigation system with automatic emergency braking, lane departure warning, upgraded leather upholstery with diamond quilted accents, along with a 19 speaker Harman Kardon sound system. A full leather interior with a lot more coverage is undoubtedly an extra cost option. Most from the summit's safety devices are also available around the overland trim level through high altitude package. A bit out of the common structure would be the high horsepower SRT trim level. It is broadly equipped such as summit trim level with some distinctions. Unique standard equipment carries a 6.4 litre V8 475 horsepower, 470 lbft, a specialized all wheel drive system tuned more for high performance driving than off road use, 20 inch wheels with performance tires, an adaptive sport tuned suspension, sport tuned steering and brakes, an activity body kit, a limit slip rear differential, and selectable performance modes. Options for your SRT such as a dual pan panoramic sunroof, two different 20 inch wheel styles carbon black or lightweight, upgraded brakes, extended and upgraded leather upholstery, the 19 speaker stereo audio, and also a towing package. Even further along the high performance rabbit hole, there is the Grand Cherokee Trackhawk. The Trackhawk gets almost all of the SRT's standard equipment in addition to the supercharged 62 litre V8 707 horsepower, 645 lbft, a substitute 8-speed transmission, an alternative adaptive suspension and Brembo brakes, more aggressive looking bodywork, and lightweight 20-inch wheels with high-performance tyres. There are some unique home design cues and upgraded upholstery to line the track hook apart from your group. Many from the higher trims standard features can be obtained on lesser models as options. The dual screen rear entertainment system with Blu-ray capability is additionally optional for your limited, trail hook, overland, summit and SRT. Quite a couple of aesthetic upgrades are available at the same time determined by trim level. Trim tested. Each vehicle typically also comes in multiple versions, although trim levels share many aspects. The S within this review provide our full test from the 2014 Jeep Grand Cherokee Summit Turbo 3.0 liters V6 diesel, 8-speed automatic, 4WD. Note, since this test was conducted, the latest Grand Cherokee has gotten some revisions, including a brand new gear shift lever, by adding electric assist power steering plus a weight reduction from some aluminium suspension components. Other findings remain applicable to this particular year's Grand Cherokee. The Trailhawk gives up slightly in ultimate handling and acceleration so they could earn off-road capability which is a cut above some other crossover. It's still nicely balanced. Those who don't go off-road might get the latitude or limited versions. Acceleration The optional 3.2-litre V6 accelerates the Trailhawk to 60 miles per hour within 8 seconds flat, a good performance in this particular class, especially taking into consideration the off-highway potential. Braking Nicely firm and responsive brake pedal and daily use. The Trailhawk snobby off road tyres spark a slightly long 131 foot panic stop from 60 miles per hour, regular Cherokees ought to do better. Steering The steering responds predictably and isn't oversensitive. The driver gets to be a good impression of what's happening down the spot that the rubber meets the path. But there is however zero kickback in rocky off-road terrain. Handling The Trailhawk's off-road tires limit ultimate on-road grip but retain good balance and coordination. And body roll isn't excessive either, in spite of the high riding stance. Drivability The Cherokee's 9-speed transmission hands over smooth upshifts and watchy downshifts. Initial throttle factor subdued, 
making for easy low speed control. Note, however, until this transmission is not also suited on the four cylinder engine. Comfort. Despite appearances, the off road watchy trailhawk isn't more harsh or uncomfortable than an SUV meant solely for street duty. It remains a snug and quiet machine you could potentially happily drive daily. Seat comfort. It's easy to find a snug driving position. The front seats proved supportive and cozy throughout an all day off road trip, and our back seat passenger was equally impressed. Ride comfort. The suspension is tuned slightly toward the soft side in promoting off road flexibility, yet it's well damped, too. The combination tends to make a smooth and pleasant ride on off the pavement. Noise and vibration. The optional 3.2 litre V6 is quiet and unobtrusive until you mash the gas pedal. The Trailhawk's bigger off road tyres are quieter than expected, but there is, however, occasional faint twitch noise. Interior The Cherokee Trailhawk does several things right. Fears more than enough room, it's simple to climb in and outside of, along with the controls are generally self-explanatory. You won't discover yourself to be thumbing with the owner's manual much. Ease people. Simple and logical audio and climate control knobs. The Uconnect navigation and infotainment method is powerful and to master. The four-wheel drive control system couldn't be easier. Getting and jetting out. The Trailhawk is taller compared to average Cherokee, nevertheless the steep in height continues to be very reasonable. The accommodating front and back doors open wide. Roominess. Fears more than enough room up front, along with the rear seat as a reliable amount of head and leg room, too. Storage bins are strategically placed regarding the cabin. Visibility. Thea's good all-around visibility that has a rear three-quarter blind spot that's no bigger or smaller compared to average. The available rear view camera is wonderful for backing away from driveways and reversing off-road. Quality. It looks well built inside and outside, but a couple in the interior trim pieces are just average. Still, absolutely nothing is likely to disappoint. Utility. The rear cargo space is often a good size and not class leading, probably because the is a full size chubby tummy under the floor. The rear seats fold flat to get more room. The door pockets are small but tend to hold a compact water bottle. Technology. Jeep Su Connect technique is well liked among many drivers. Its large graphics are clear and simple to watch. Pairing using your phone is not hard, and operation for regular entertainment functions requires no manual. Yeah. <laughs>